Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, the election was conducted in 38,622 polling stations across the country and in 275 constituencies. I'll now turn my attention to the reason why we are here. At the end of a transparent, fair, orderly, and timely and peaceful presidential election, the total number of valid votes cast was 13,434,574, representing 79% of the total registered voters. Permit me to present the results in the order of appearance on the 2020 presidential ballot. At the end of the polls, Nana Dodankwa Akufuado of the New Patriotic Party obtained 6,730,413 votes, being 51.595% of the total valid votes cast. John Dramani Mahama of the National Democratic Congress obtained 6,214,889 votes, being 47.366% of the total valid votes cast. Christian Kwabna Andrews of the Ghana Union Movement obtained 105,565 votes, being 0.805% of the total valid votes cast. Iva Kabana Greenstreet of the Convention's People's Party obtained 12,215 votes, being 0.093% of the total valid votes cast. Madam Ekuya Donko, of the Ghana Freedom Party obtained 5,575 votes, being 0.042% of the total valid votes cast. Henry Herbert Latte of the Great Consolidated Popular Party obtained 3,574, being 0.027% of the total valid votes cast. Hassan Ayariga of the All People's Party obtained 7,140, being 0.054% of the total valid votes cast. Percival Kofi Apalu of the Liberal Party of Ghana obtained 7,690 votes, being 0.059% of the total valid votes cast. David Asibi Apesara of the People's National Convention obtained 10,887, being 0.083% of the total valid votes cast. Bridget Akosua Jigbonuku of the Progressive People's Party obtained 6,848 votes, being 0.052% of the total valid votes cast. Nana Kunedu Ajiman Rawlings of the National Democratic Party obtained 6,612 votes, being 0.050% of the total valid votes cast. Alfred Kwame Isiedu Walker, independent candidate, obtained 9,703 votes, being 0.074% of the total valid votes cast. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, currently the election results we have declared exclude that of the Techiman South constituency, which has a total voter population of 128,018. 128,018. The said election results are not ready because they are being contested. As such, collation has not been completed. It is important to note, however, that the difference between the total number of votes between the first and second candidates is 515,000 
524 votes. As a result, if we were to add the 128,018 full results to the results of the second candidate, it would not change the outcome of the election. Hence, our declaration of the 2020 presidential results without that of Techiman South. Indeed, if you were to add the entire results or collate all the results from the Techiman South constituency and add that to the, 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 the percentage and the votes of the second candidate, Mr. John Dramani Mahama, he would obtain 47.873% of the total votes cast. And Nana Dodankwa Akufuado would obtain 50.8% of the total votes cast. It is on that basis that we say that the outcome of the election would not change. Hence, our declaration of the 2020 presidential results without that of Techiman South. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, on the basis of the foregoing election results, and by the power vested in me as the chairperson of the Electoral Commission of Ghana, and the returning officer of the presidential election, it is my duty and honor to declare Nana Dankwa Akufuado as president-elect of the Republic of Ghana. May God bless our homeland, Ghana, and make our nation great and strong. Let peace reign. Thank you. <laughs>